Welcome back everyone to Power to the Pricing People. Now in our last episode we discussed margaritas, manufacturing and margins. So continuing with that M theme, our first story today is about McDonald's, the perfect antidote to too many margaritas. Unfortunately, those craving their favorite all meat or veg patty and cheese, cushioned between two soft sesame seed buns from Maccas in India, may be disappointed to find one key ingredient missing across the entire menu, tomatoes. Due to skyrocketing prices, which rose by nearly 300% in a single month, the fast food chain has decided to remove tomatoes from all food items until further notice. This is causing many people to travel to neighboring Nepal to purchase tomatoes at a more affordable price, as tomatoes are a staple ingredient in many Indian meals. In other pricing news, Nike recently announced that their revenue has surpassed $50 billion. They also revealed plans to re-establish wholesale partnerships with retailers that they had previously withdrawn from two years ago. Knight recognises that not all customers prefer to shop directly and is diversifying its channel mix to protect volume. This strategic omni-channel pricing strategy deployed by Nike serves as an excellent lesson for all brands, manufacturers, wholesalers and retailers to learn from. And that's exactly what your friends here at Flintbox are here to help with. One of our B2B retail wholesale customers faced challenges expanding their channel strategy because they had no means of carrying over special pricing from bricks and mortar stores to the new e-commerce platform. However, with a touch of Flint Fox magic, they were able to achieve remarkable growth in their e-commerce sales. In just six months, their e-commerce sales went from zero to a million dollars, and they are now approaching 40 million in sales through their e-com channel. So if you would like a slice of the omni-channel pie, just do it. We'll be thrilled to show you how. Until next time, power to you pricing people.